Hey, what's up fellow YouTubers, fellow Toy Nuts and Toy Collectors, this is Starscream1988. Today I have, as you can see on the header, and that's probably why you're looking at the video, I have another toy sale. So I'm going to break this down in a couple of my very rough editing. <laughs> Where actually, I don't do any editing, as you guys know, I just, I'll cut and you'll see me doing the next batch. Um, unfortunately, I'm using this small little table here compared to the last two sales that I had, which I had a nice big table. But anyway, so I'm going to start with what I think is the, the probably the least expensive of some of these toys going. Now, I'm going to be brutally, brutally honest, guys. With these, I'm not even going to give you a price. I just wanted some offers. And be reasonable, obviously. Yes, they are open. But I will specify each and every one of them as best as I can. I, I am a collector, just like a lot of you guys know. Um, or if you don't know, I yes, I am a collector. Um, I keep my toys as mint as possible. Yes, they are loose, but they're usually separated in baggies and whatever not. Um, on the movie figures, uh, just give me some offers. And if it's unreasonable, I'm not even going to reply. I'm going to be totally, totally brutally honest. I'm not even going to reply. Um, you know what they were at retail. Um, you know what they should cost at you know being open. It's usually around half. Um, some of them might go up in value, but I really don't care about that. I really do want to take care of um, my fellow subscribers. There's already been a few of you that have purchased from me. And for those, you know, four or five people out there, thank you so much. Um, and it's kind of funny that all five of you were crazy. Everybody sent me cash, which is <laughs> the craziest thing. But I am very um, honest. And those people that have received toys from me, um, they know that, yeah, they, you know, they, they sent me cash. I, I did receive it. I would suggest, though, guys, um, please do money orders. I mean, it's for your protection. Um, if you mail it, it gets lost. At least, you know, you, you can take my word for it that I didn't, I didn't take your money because I'm not, I'm not here to, to make, you know, enemies or, um, you know, to have bad feelings. I mean, I, I love my YouTube channel. And to be totally honest, guys, it's kind of my only source of income right now. So I'm not working. But in saying that, that doesn't mean that I'm going to drop my pants, as they say in the business. Um, if you if you've ever sold cars for a living like I did a long, long time ago. Yeah, I'm not dropping my pants. So I, it's not that I need the money badly. The money is just so I can buy more toys, guys, to be totally honest. So I do get AdSense, which is great. And, and it is because of you guys, my viewers and my subscribers. Um, but it's, it's you know, I'm not Shang Long. I'm not Piog. And I'm not off the bottom. So I don't get the buku dollars like they do. So again, in saying that, um, just you know, be reasonable with these. So again, um, I'm gonna try to describe every single one of them as best as possible. If there's any defects or anything, uh, and I'll start with that with the defective one. Now here, as you can see, I have RC, really nice toy. If you need her in your collection, she does have a problem though. She won't hold her missile. Um, it does shoot. It's not broken. Sorry, I just got out of focus there. It just it won't hold. It barely holds, and she's missing her skiff there. So, you know, just, again, an offer. She's not, not broken or anything. Mm, excuse me. But um, she's really nice. I mean, if you're buying a few of them, then obviously she'll be included in the lot and whatever not. So, again, just reasonable prices, guys. All right. So, I'm going to actually take her out of focus as I'm going here. Um, here we have um, side swipe, as you can see. 100% complete. Really nice. Very common. But, again, you might need them. So, whatever. Um, next, we have... A little bit harder to find laser beak very very cool i was actually going to keep this i was going to do a, a um buzzsaw um scheme i was going to paint them and i just noticed that there's not enough screws for me to unscrew them, especially when it comes to the turbines here and so i was going to have to do a lot of free handing painting and so i just kind of did not want to deal with that because i would have to use the brush and i really wanted to use um my spray my um, airbrush um, I know I could still do it, but I just, I don't know. It seems like I'm going to waste a lot of paint. So, uh, but yeah, so here's laser beak. Um, here is Devastator. No, so that's what they call them in the movie. But as you all know, this is Bra. He is also 100%. He has his projectile, his back pieces there, which usually tend to be missing with a lot of people. So there he is. Um, a very also 100% complete um, cliff jumper. Yes, this is the remold of Bumblebee. So you're not seeing a weird color scheme. It's just it, it is Bumblebee, but it's Cliff Jumper. This is um, um, laser gun um, knife thingy. So he's in awesome, awesome condition too. Um, another very cool one, Dirge. Not super hard to find. I mean, again, a lot of these movie toys are common, 
but it is a very very cool toy nevertheless and again this is another one that i kind of kept up uh, I, I thought of keeping i have i still have a lot of repeat jets that i want to um, paint in different color schemes i just i couldn't in my head think of what i would want to do with him um but yeah so there you go dirge here is the mighty megatron and the only thing missing with him is his cow or his cow or his cloak um, well this is part of his cloak but he is missing the headpiece um, a lot of people don't use it in their display because some people find it stupid but um in truck mode obviously you can still do that uh the other part would just be in there and you know you just cover it there but he is again 100 percent complete um he still has his moving features and all that it's actually one of the toys that um at first i hated it when it first came out and i just bought it because i'm a completist or whatever but uh, I've, I've actually grown to love this damn thing i don't know why i think it's a really cool mold so but that's just me my opinion all right um the very famous barricade and this is the version with friendly uh friendly <laughs> with frenzy so this is the version with frenzy as you can see there so and he's not broken or anything Sometimes uh, I've seen people, you know, it's missing its arms or the legs cracked or whatever. Um, so there is an interrogator version. Um, if you have the interrogator part, that actually does fit there. He is in awesome condition, no scratches or anything. Again, none of these are scratched or anything. They're in really awesome condition. So that was Barricade. Um, here is Fallen, as you can see there. An awesome, awesome shape also. So... I have the burning version or fire version and then, you know, another version of this. So um, I didn't need a third one. I wasn't going to try to customize it. I thought of, uh, you know, I had some ideas, but then I was like, eh, whatever. I just really don't have the time. I wish I did. Um, and then the last three, put that there, put that there, and put him here. Here is, um, crap, I forgot his name, guys. I do apologize. Um, Swerve? No, it's not Swerve. Um, I know he's a robot. There's supposed to be hundreds of him in the video game or whatever. Um, he has a very swindle, maybe. Maybe this is swindle actually. I think this is swindle. Um, still, you know, everything's working as you can see. Um, well, yeah, we'll call him swindle for now. I could be totally wrong. If I'm wrong, I'm, I apologize. Uh, but yeah, so um, if by the time I put this video up, if I remember, if I do find out what it is, you'll see it in the top there or whatever or on the side there i should say but yeah here's this guy um the very cool first um star scream i have every single jet that um has been made of this mold and um i just you know when i first had him as an extra it's because i thought of painting him something that would be missing but they almost pretty much covered every single um plane the only thing i think they didn't do was a thrust maybe and a dirge so those are the only two missing. But other than that, though, they cover everyone. They even did a G1 version color scheme of this. Um, if you've seen it out there, you know, I got the Skywalk, got the Thundercrack, got all of them. So um, there's no reason for me to to have an extra one now, seeing as I have them all now. Um, but yeah, so you know, somebody out there can enjoy them. It's pretty cool. It's a little bit, um, a lot of kibble there in the bottom, as you can see. Um, not very movie accurate. I think the second one is a little bit better. So you know, again, I'm being honest. I think the second one is a little bit better, so if you want to wait for that, then that's something you should pick up. But if you're just a completist and you need him for some reason, you just started collecting, then there you go. I have a Starscream 100% complete with all six projectiles. Cool. And then last but not least, my man, Optimus Prime. Now, unfortunately, this Optimus Prime here is from the first movie. Um, this is really for parts, guys. I mean, if, you, if you're for some reason, you bought a lot and you have the pieces that are missing here... Or, you know, yours came with no tires because these do come out. These are pretty cool because it's real rubber. Then this is a piece for you. Or maybe this is your first one and you don't care about how it looks. Um, he will look, he does look awesome in, in his um, robot mode when you transform him. He does work. I actually put brand new batteries in there. Um, again, the, there's two unfortunate things missing. Unfortunately, and I wish I had it because if I had it, it's something you could um, crazy glue. But he is missing one of his smokestacks. Um, if you're very into crafts, you could actually build yourself one out of, I don't know, some material out there. Maybe you could do aluminum and then paint it, or you could do some, I don't know, plate, not Play-Doh, but yeah, some, you know, I don't know, something like that. Um, he is missing one of his, um, his shoulder guards or whatever you want to call it. 
um, and he doesn't have his gun. So again, he's not very complete. Um, I know a lot of people are gonna say, oh, you know, I need one, but that's not the way that I want. And I totally understand. I mean, I, I just happen to have two of every Optimus out there. Not all of them, but you know, a, a good amount. So um, this was my third one. And um, when I got this, it's because I was actually missing these. So, you know, I got those, the pieces that I need and whatever not. So this is what I have left. Again, this is something that I was gonna paint, but um, I said, you know, why even bother painting it? Somebody else could probably use it out there. So again, um, with all prices that you offer me, please remember that um, you are paying for your own shipping. So um, the more you buy, then maybe I can give you a better package deal, guys. So um, again, these are William Movie Toys. So um, next up will be some other ones. Okay, and next we have now uh, a mixed lot. There are some Armada, Energon maybe, um, Cybertron for sure. A um, couple RIDs, and um, yeah, that's basically it. So I'll go with the biggest one here so I can kind of get him out of the way. There's um, Scourge right there. Um, he's in okay shape. Um, it's a nice display piece for sure. Um, he does have a couple defects. As you can see, he's kind of scratched there a little bit. Um, he is missing his, like, I believe they're, like, kind of like hand guards. You know, you kind of flip them up. I guess they, they get lost easily. My actual version is mint but um, and that's because i have the takara version but um yeah this one um i acquired through a lot of whatever um he does work unfortunately his batteries are almost dead see so it just needs new batteries but you heard that um obviously has his tail nothing's broken um except for that one piece right there but again if you need it as a display piece or you're buying a couple transformers then obviously i'll give you a good deal on them um, I'm not gonna rape you on it as they say so there you go so that's scourge right there sorry that he was so close to the camera a um, couple guys just in case if you're missing these guys to make your rail racer your little RID transformer um, you know you can buy these as a lot um, maybe you have three out of the six or, or you're just missing a few as long as you have the body you can um, you know build them I, I just I don't need them I don't need extras I'm trying to actually get rid of a lot of my doubles um, for certain um, series. So if you need these, you know, give me an offer on those. All right. Um, uh, one of my very, very favorite Transformers of all. I actually had four of these at one point. <laughs> Why? I have no idea. I just really like them a lot. This is Downshift, a.k.a. Wheeljack. Um, when you transform him, his face looks just like Wheeljack. Um, I think he was meant to be Wheeljack, but for whatever reason, he, they couldn't get the name, and they just, I don't know, whatever it is. But yeah, this guy's 100% complete. Now, what I mean by that is 100% complete in terms of his weapons. I don't have extra keys, guys, so please don't ask me. Um, if, I, if I do have an extra key, maybe I'll send it with it, but it's not guaranteed. Hopefully, if you have any Armada or Energon toys, I mean, they, they all have keys, guys, so... Um, you know, you, you can do that. I'm sorry, not Energon, Cybertron. So this is a Cybertron toy. So if you, you know, any key will work. Other than that, he is in awesome, awesome shape. I really, really love this toy. I still have two left. So um, I got rid of one a long time ago, and this is my third one. So there you go. So downshift. Um, Exelion, aka Hot Shot. So this is the red version. It looks just like Rodimus or Heart Rod. So he does have his weapon there. Again, no key. But if you have a key, it's not a big deal. So keys are dumb. I doesn't. I just don't have any more extras anymore. I mean, if I do, I'll send it, but I doubt it. So this is a Speed Planet key or whatever toy. So there you go. Um, the very cool. Um, actually, I, I mean, I like these a lot. Actually, um, I had an extra one of these um, for the longest because um, I owned the other four. Um, I have the R.I.D. Sunstorm, but they just never bothered. I don't know why they just don't make thrusts or dirges really that that much. They they do ram ramjets every so often, even in terms of even the movie series. There's a ramjet, but there's no dirge, and there's no um, thrust. So um, I was gonna custom paint them as one of those guys, but again, I just don't have the time. Um, and like I said, I, I do need the cash. So, um, but he does work, as you can see. Everything flips. If you take him off, he makes the other sound effect. So he is in awesome, awesome condition, guys. So again, give me an offer and, you know, be reasonable. Um, and that's basically it. So we'll put that back. All 
All right. Next is from RID. I like to actually sell these a set only because, um, you know, I bought these a long time ago um, in a lot, um, like five, six months ago, whatever. And unfortunately, I bought them because I needed the third guy. So I know you're missing one, which is Midnight Express. This is, um, it's either or, but it's rapid run and um, rail something. Um, but, you know, what's, what's wrong with these is that if you can see there, whoever owned these before... Um, must have left them out like in the in the window something windowsill they do have some sunburn so maybe you need one to you can custom paint it or whatever which is a reason why i kept it this long um and i didn't get rid of it um this one's really bad um my actual version i don't have a 100 complete set myself yet i'm actually still missing this arm and um you know, when I bought this set is because I was missing the arm, so I figured, oh, you know, I'll have the arm or, you know, another version. Unfortunately, I, I, I just don't want to paint it because I know it'll never look right. Um, it's already burnt on both arms, um, and it matches this one. And Midnight Express is actually like a gray color, so there's no way you can get a sunburn version of that because, you know, it's not white plastic. So it just, it wouldn't match. Maybe you need it for whatever reason. Um, he does have part of his weapon. He is missing the projectile, um, but he does have at least this part here. This guy does not have his weapon, so I mean, I'll sell, I'll sell them, I'll sell them individual if, if you only need one out of the two. But um, I would rather sell them together, to be honest. But you know, whatever. So that's these two guys there. Um, here is one of the um, trucks from um, the um, Build King. So, I mean, not much to say other than, you know, he's, he's complete, whatever. So maybe you have the other three and you're missing this guy here. So there you go. I even forgot his name. <laughs> um, this guy here is 100% complete. As you can see, his tanks are still attached. Um, take my word for it. Actually, I'll just show you. Laser beak is in there. He's right there, as you can see. So, and he does have his original key. One of the very few toys. And that's actually the actual, um, if you're into collecting actual keys, they go for the real toe, which I do myself. I know it's kind of anal and stupid, but I actually have all the original keys to all my actual um, Cybertron toys. Um, so, But yeah, that is its original key. That's the original code. If you don't believe me, you can go to um, tfwiki.net and that tells you all the codes. Um, again, he's 100% complete. Uh, I'm just going to throw him. The, the legends version only because he's actually missing um this part here so um if he transform it's gonna look stupid without it so that's just a throw in so you can have baby um sound wave i don't know if i just called the megatron i apologize if i did but you, you have baby sound wave with big sound wave so um again make me an offer but be reasonable he is a little bit harder to find and they can be a little expensive so uh, probably just as much as they would be a retail um new so we'll just keep it that way. Last but not least, I have this guy here. Um, very cool. Unfortunately, there is only one problem with it. These guys tend to break very easily. So I'm telling you right off the bat, this is my actual um, version. I'm not selling this one. I'm only selling this one here, just in case if you need the parts or whatever. As you can see, the copter, there is a little... Um, peg right there you can't twist these because they do break and unfortunately it did break as you can see there um again it, you don't need them to display them like this as it doesn't matter um as you can see they're identical other than i got their feet backwards or whatever but um if you were for some reason displaying it like this then he is missing his back part uh, maybe you might want to super glue it i don't know whatever uh, but they all transform, they're all complete, none are broken. So um, this guy is also for sale. Um, with him, I'll be a little bit honest, they're kind of tough to find. So I'm, you know, I'm, I'm looking, f I'm going to be honest, for, for definitely more than 10. So um, no, no, no offers for, for less than $10 on this. You know, 10, 15, 20. Um, I think I've seen people sell them for even with this peg thing broken for maybe 15 20 bucks so um, but yeah so that's that cool so uh, let's check out the next ones okay and yet again 
these are more on the you side i understand what they are so uh, you do too um if anybody's needing an extra optimus maybe for parts maybe yours looks like hell this one's actually in really nice condition as you can see um it does actually have its um wings back there which is always missing from used toys it is missing the chest piece as you can see there and it's missing the clear guns and stuff and obviously it doesn't have the trailer but if you if you have one and yours is wrecked then this one's in really really nice condition it's a little faded there but um this is cheap money guys i, I mean i'm not gonna ask much for this so again good offer um my man here bulkhead you've probably seen him in a few videos um i would always uh, use i use them a few times still works he is missing his missiles and his lid and the headmaster but again if you need him for parts or you just need him in general when you do transform he still looks really nice so i probably should have done that so you can kind of appreciate it better i just didn't have time so anyway so that's that a couple g1s here you've probably seen me. these are throttle bots the dual cons i should say actually they are 100 percent i would rather sell them as a set but if you only need one out of the two then um that's fine also and i'll kind of transform them real quick just so you can kind of uh, see what it's all about all right these are original g1 guys they don't do much they have almost no posability but they're just cool for display as you can see i mean it's a cool toy in general period but um and again they are 100 percent complete both of them they have the rub signs and everything so and then this one goes here and that flips forward down those are his little arms but he doesn't really hold them so you just take this and it goes right here on the side and that's it so there you go there's the two dual cons um i'm gonna be straight up with with you guys for the set i'm looking for 30 shipped um if you only need one then obviously 15 dollars shipped and they are complete and they are, they are a pain in the ass to usually get. And I think that's a pretty reasonable pricing as they have both of their weapons. The propeller's nice and straight. It's not broken. Um, it still rolls fine. It goes for both of them, whatever. So, um, actually that doesn't roll because it doesn't have treads. But it holds well, as you can see. So, again, um, 30 for the set shipped, which I think is really reasonable. Um, or 15 each shipped. And um, obviously it would go slow. Slow ass mail so there you go guys cool um one item here and like he just didn't fit yes omega supreme and he is so big so as you can see there omega supreme um i'm gonna be totally honest i don't want to let this guy go and by you guys buying anything from me I, it, you'd be helping me out to be totally honest so i'm not gonna front um the only thing is again i kind of don't want to let this guy go I just checked eBay, a lot of the completed listings. Um, in this condition, and I'll tell you what's wrong with it, almost nothing. He is missing his two projectiles. Um, people try to sell the pair for like $10 each, maybe $8 each shipped. Um, he does work. His lights are working. As you can see there. Um, on this particular toy, these flaps here for when you form the bridge seem to always be missing when you buy them used this tends to be sometimes missing there's an auction that i just saw closed or it's about to close um, this whole section here which moves is just ripped so you can buy it for 75 dollars and it comes with a couple other toys but everything seems to be broken but it comes with a scorponok something else in the auction it comes with this guy but this is broken this piece here so it's not like you can put it back and it seems to be missing these parts here um the guy's asking for 75 dollars shipped with basically junk toys to be honest um and uh, no no to discredit to him i mean he's he's just selling stuff like me um and he's honest about it. he's like you know as is whatever um this guy is again only missing those two items and the last probably thing that would be a big deal is his head is actually missing a leg but if this is to be a display piece as just only omega supreme as you can as you saw there um it's not hindering it again i really don't want to sell it but if i did have to sell it i am asking for straight up 
you might think it's crazy so obviously I'll definitely can go elsewhere that's fine I'm not gonna be offended I'm looking for 80 bones ship and only because I'm, I have a feeling that it's going to be at least fifteen dollars to ship because of the size and the weight, um, and you know any of the fifty states. So I'm, I'm looking for eighty dollars. If not, then that's fine. Um, he doesn't have to leave because that is one piece that I would love to. And there's been a few uh, out there. Um, I would definitely, definitely want to take my time and probably do him in G1 colors because I think he's. It's just a. This is a it's a marvelous toy. I think it's a real cool toy. Um, and then with the new reissue coming out pretty soon, sometime next year, um, I think all three of them and their three different colors, I, I think will look awesome. So again, if he doesn't sell, that's fine. Um, but yeah, I'm looking for 80, 80 shipped. So, and again, you just kind of be basically helping me out. So that's that. Cool. On to the next items here. I'm not even going to pause this time. Um, don't worry, he just, it sounded like he fell, but he didn't, something else fell. A <laughs> um, couple of closed items, um, non-transformers, you can see I have Archangel there, he is mint in package. Um, this is not the very first release, so no bullshitting you guys, as you can see this is the fans choice winner, I believe it's the second one. Um, even though it looks like the first one, well, maybe it is the first one. Series two, number five. It, may, it could be a second, uh, a second one that came out. Um, I'm looking for shipped on this, um, twenty bucks, guys. So if you can find it for cheaper, again, you know, it's it's cool. Um, but if you you know know me as a subscriber, if you've purchased from me before, or you're new to purchase, then feel you know feel fine and free and. To, um, to know that I, I, this will be shipped to you. And again, you'll be helping me out. Um, another item that's mint in package. This is my last of the um, Hulks. And this is Compound Hulk. Um, I'm looking for him shipped. Um, 35 bucks, guys. So if this is something that you need, then, you know, there you go. And again, I, I won't feel offended if you think it's too much. I understand. Um, again, I'm, I'm trying to be reasonable with some toys with some I want a little bit more because I don't need to sell it But if I did then you just be helping me out or whatever. So So 35 bucks and 20 bucks shipped. I think that's what I said, right? Yeah, 35 and 20 If you buy them together, maybe I can save you another five bucks um, If you need this turtles here um, Shipped 10 bucks only because I just want five and it's gonna cost at least Actually, it might end up costing like six dollars. So I'm only really gonna make four dollars out of it. So if you need a Casey Jones mint in package, it's a little crease there, but um, yeah, ten bucks, guys. Cool. And actually, that my brother gave me that, but I'm selling it. A uh, couple more open items. These are these I had shown before. Um, again, on the Marvel Legends here, saber tooth there. Um, I'm only asking for him shipped. Um, uh, 12, 12, 13 bucks. I'm over in here. Um, nine bucks shipped. No stand included. Sorry, I am keeping my stand. Um, this little Spidey here, which is kind of cool. Um, six dollars shipped. So I'll, I'll send them first class. I think first class is a dollar eighty-five. Um, and this. Uh, Moon Knight here. Uh, I'll send them uh, eight dollars shipped, because again, two dollars for shipping, so six dollars for the figure. So let's recap. So eight dollars shipped, six dollars shipped, nine dollars shipped, and uh, we'll we'll do him just for twelve dollars shipped for the saber tooth. All right, guys. Cool. All right. Um. Let me um, set these next guys up, and uh, we'll be right back. Okay, and here we have, for the G.I. Joe fans out there, have a Minton Package Skysweeper Jet with Air Raid. Never been opened. Uh, the box is in okay condition. There's this file card down there. Um, that's a little loose there, but again, it's never been opened. What's the actual real tape there folks it's never been messed with all right so for him i'm looking for um 15 shipped 
I think is pretty reasonable. Um, got some loose guys here. Uh, I do apologize. I can't remember if that might not even go with this guy, but this is what I have left. Um, I don't have lift ticket for this. This is the reissue. He is complete, as you can see. The ghost hot's really nice. I actually like it more than the original, to be honest. Um, think the details so much better. Um, uh, for this, I'm looking for um, ten bucks shipped. Um, for this guy here, the jet pack, I'm looking for eight dollars shipped. Okay, and he does fit there. He does have both his missiles, which is pretty cool. Um, and again, I know that's not his driver. This is actually for the Raven, but. Um, I figure I include him with it. It's just I like him a lot. He's the Strato Viper, I believe, right? Um, yeah, this is again another issue. Unfortunately, it's missing a missile, so that kind of sucks. But um, even then, though, I'm looking for uh, for this um, ten dollars shipped. So there you go. And then I have two um, authentic authentic vintage um, Joes um, here. Mint in package. Unfortunately, no far card. This is Ace, and usually he's tough because his visor is always broken. He's in really, really nice condition. He will come with this package here. Um, I'm looking for him since, seeing as he is missing his um, far card, I'm looking for um, 15 um, shipped. He he's worth a lot more, so I think 15 is pretty cool. Um, and then here with Snake Eyes, I'm sorry, not Snake Eyes, Blasphemy, <laughs> Storm Shadow, uh, I do have all his weapons, um, as, a, as a matter of fact, I have an extra claw, I um, have his sword, backpack, his um, bow, arrows, he is in awesome, awesome condition, um, very tight still, he does come with his file card, he will come in this case here, um, him I'm looking for um, 20 shipped. Uh, I've seen him go for a lot more than that too, so I think that's pretty reasonable. You guys let me know. And so then um, I have one more to show you um, in terms of toys, and uh, we'll go from there. Cool. Okay, folks, and then these are the last ones for the night. These are the long shots. <laughs> these are for the real, real collectors out there. So I don't expect many offers on these if any um actually i'm gonna cut to the chase there are no offers on these i have prices for these and if you think they're great cool if not then that's fine again um i don't i do appreciate it and i really you know if i can sell them great um but i i, I you know if, if i can't sell them whatever I, I i keep them so there's there's no um no um no lost feelings so as you can see these are strictly g1s except for the um, reissue Takara there, but he is considered a G1 toy. Um, we'll start with the side swipe. This is an authentic G1, or actually, you can't even call it G1. This is a Diaclone, guys. This is DK1. This is the one that started it all. This is the authentic side swipe, very first color ever. Um, no fists, no rockets, nothing. He is in really, really nice shape, though. I'll transform him real quick there. Um, can't do them on a retro fighter review only because he is missing everything now these as as is without weapons because you can use um the reissue stuff or you can use the um um sun sunstreaker uh, did i call him side swipe i'm sorry guys i mean sunstreaker um you can use the um the sunstreaker um where is it uh Oops, let's see, that's not, I just popped that off. Why can't I transform this? Oh, that's why. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, so, an original sun, um, sun Streaker from the Diaclone line. These sell, guys, any day of the week. These are 80 bucks, you know, um, on eBay, as is. No weapons, no fists. Obviously, once they complete, they're in the hundreds. Um, I'm looking for... Um, I'm looking for 70 shipped, so it's only $10 off, but again, that's, you know, when they're selling for 80, that's not including shipping half the time, so I'm looking for 70 shipped, guys, um, unless maybe, uh, if you, give me a best offer, again, keep it reasonable, if you're buying other stuff, too, so again, um, original Diaclone Sunstreaker, guys, 
So he is, has all his, his tires are still intact, all four of them. He's in really nice shape. Again, you can still use the fists and the weapons from any Sunstreaker, whether it's a reissue or the original, whatever. But this is, again, the original Diaclone, guys. So there we go. So that's that. Um, next is um, Shockwave, as you can see there. He is in really, really nice condition still. Um, the only thing that's broken, which is always, is the little tab there. But as you can see, it's still holding fine. He still makes his goofy sound. Very annoying. So if you want to piss off your parents, his scope is still intact. So there you go, guys. He is in awesome condition. Um, if you see my review on him, um, I don't like him much, but I do know what he's worth. Um, little hairpin loss there, as you can see. So it, this happens with a lot of these toys, guys. So um, this side is a lot better. Um, I'm looking for him shipped. Also 80 bucks, guys. So this is an original G1. Um, they cost a lot more than that usually. So let me actually transform for you real quick. So you can see what it looks like just in case if you never saw my review. His head still pops as you can see. Come over here, bring that forward. I feel like I'm doing a tour review. <laughs> uh, bring those over, bring these carefully here. These do tend to get stressed a lot too. So that's why I'm being very, very, very careful. All right, that one's there. And I, I, I try not to pull from the bottom. You should always pull from the top. There you go, so he's in there. So I'm just being as careful as possible. Um, he has his metal toes here. There he is. He is tough to hold because he's older. Um, let's see. Yeah, he's he's top heavy. But there he is. All right. So 80 bones on the shockwave. Um, Megatron here, unfortunately, is missing his fusion cannon. That tends to be a little bit of pain in the ass to find. Maybe you already have one at home. The reissue for the Takara version actually is, I believe it's the same exact color. So that would work if you can find one of those too. Um, for him, um, 60 shipped. He does have his extra gun. All right. So not much more to say. Oh, he does work actually. Let me show you that. It does have all the three funky sounds or whatever. But yeah, so if you see my, re I, I do have a review on this. You can check that out. So again, that works. All right. On the Takara reissue. I'm looking for eighty dollars also. So again, these are the long shots. <laughs> these people might be like, "You got, you're fucking crazy, dude." Excuse my French. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm looking for eighty dollars on him. I don't need to sell him, but he's in he's in great condition. There you go. That's selling him Megatron. So as you can see, he does work. He comes with his matrix. He does have everything. He's hundred percent. Has the stickers, all that good stuff. So he's he's beautiful. So again, there you go. And last but not least, um, if you guys saw my review on these guys, these are the Pretender um, Monstructor. They form one big um, um, Gestalt. Um, he, one of the guys I can't remember now, but one of them is missing the little gun. Um, and that's basically it he is 99 percent complete if you saw my review on it he is super hard to find um these have never been reissued um these only came obviously single packed um they're from the tail end of the line so they're super super hard to come by um they are again com you know they're complete all their parts you can see that they're in there um if you need to see a further look on them you can just check out my review that I did on them. So, um, what am I asking for? Okay, well, there's no completed listings on these guys. So, it's kind of tough to see what they have been selling for. Um, I will tell you right now. You can check for yourself, obviously. And I expect everybody to do their homework. Um, everybody seems to want at least 100 for each one. 
So we're talking that's six hundred dollars if you were to buy separately and take your time. So you know, spending six hundred dollars in one year if you did one every other month, that's that's reasonable. Um, if you want them all together, there's a guy selling them for four hundred. Um, for you, my eBay friends, I am looking for three forty shipped. So I know that's a lot of money, but um, yeah, that's that's what I'm asking. And again, it seems everybody wants minimum of like between eighty and a hundred dollars shipped for each one. Um, some of them sometimes include the card. Some of them, some of them include the bio, obviously. Um, make them package. I know they're at least one hundred fifty dollars each. So now you know you're looking at eight hundred bucks. Is it? Yeah, eight hundred dollars. So <laughs> it can be pricey. So um, nine hundred dollars. Sorry. I know there's people out there actually selling the set mint and card for thing twelve hundred. So they are pricey, pricey toys, guys. So they, this is for the real collector out there. Again, guys, no cash for anything. Please try to send me money orders. I mean, if you're buying, I guess, a ten dollar toy, then it is a ten dollar toy. So you know you can do that. So you don't have to spend a dollar in a money order. But um, uh, for this last lot, I'm I'm, I'm looking honestly for three forty. Um, so there you go. So guys, as always, thank you for watching. Um, and um yeah you know starts let let the bidding wars begin <laughs> you guys take care peace see you later